Good morning, grade 8. Today we will continue in chapter 5, Percentage and Proportionality. As a reminder of the formulas, the new price is equal to A times the old price, where A is equal to 100 minus R over 100 if we decrease R percent, or A is equal to 100 plus R over 100 if we increase R percent. And if we have two successive changes, then A in this case is equal to A1 times A2. Please open your books on page 38 in order to solve number 1. Part 1. The original price of an item is 60,000 Lebanese pounds. Its price increases by 15%. Find its final price. New price is equal to A times all the price, and we have to find A. Since we have an increase in price, then A is equal to 100 plus R over 100, then A is equal to 100 plus 15 over 100, A is equal to 1.15, and therefore the new price is equal to 1.15 times the old price which is 60,000 therefore the new price is 69,000 Lebanese pounds in part 2 the price of an object after a 20% discount is 64,000 Lebanese pounds what is its initial price the initial price is the old price which is equal to the new price over a we have to find a a is equal to 100 minus R over 100. Since we have a discount, that means we have a decrease in price. Then A is equal to 100 minus 20 over 100. A is equal to 0 0.8. Then the old price is equal to 64,000, which is the new price over A, which is 0 0.8. Then the old price is 80,000 Lebanese pounds. In part 3, the initial price of an object is $90. After a change, its price becomes $67.5. Find the percentage of change. The percentage of change is R. And in order to find R, first of all we have to find A which is equal to the new price over the old price. Then A is equal to 67.5 over 90. A is equal to 0 0.75, which is less than 1. Then we have a decrease in price. Therefore, we have to use the formula A equal 100 minus R over 100. And A is equal to 0 0.75, then 0 0.75 is equal to 100 minus R over 100. We make a cross multiplication in order to find R. Then 100 minus R equals 75. Minus R is equal to 75 minus 100. Minus R is equal to minus 25. Therefore, R is equal to 25%. Then the percentage of change is 25%. In part 4, the original price of an item is 20,000 Lebanese pounds. Its price increases by 20%, then decreases by 20%. Find the percentage of change and its new price. The percentage of change is R, and in order to find R, we have to find A. A is in equal in this case to a1 times a2 since we have two successive changes an increase by 20 percent and a decrease by 20 percent then a is equal to 100 plus 20 over 100 times 100 minus 20 over 100 then a is equal to 0 0.96 which is less than 1 then we have a decrease in price so to find R, we have to use the formula A equal 100 minus R over 100. 
a in this case is equal to 0 0.96 then 0 0.96 equal 100 minus r over 100 we make a cross multiplication and we get 100 minus r equal 96 then r is equal to 100 minus 96 r is equal to 4 percent we still have to find the new price the new price is equal to a times old price and we already found a which is equal to 0 0.96 then the new price is equal to 0 0.96 times the old price which is 20,000 then the new price is 19,200 Lebanese pounds in part 5 if each year prices increase by 10 percent then how much will they increase at the end of two years here we have to find the percentage of change which is r and in order to find r first of all we have to find a if we can see here in this example we have two years and each year the prices increase by 10 percent then we have two successive changes so we have to find a using the formula a1 times a2 a1 is equal to 100 plus 10 over 100 since the first year the prices increased by 10 percent times 100 plus 10 over 100 which is a2 since the second year we also have another increase by 10 percent then a is equal to 100 plus 10 over 100 times 100 plus 10 over 100 a is equal to 1.21 which is greater than 1 so we have an increase in price so we use the formula a equal 100 plus r over 100 in order to find r with a equal 1.21 so 1.21 equal 100 plus r over 100 and we make a cross multiplication we get 100 plus r equal 121 then r is equal to 121 one minus 100 therefore r is equal to 21 percent in part six the price of an object increases by 15 percent then by five percent find the percentage of increase which is r so first of all we have to find a which is equal to a1 times a2 since we have two successive changes the first change is an increase by 15 percent then a1 is equal to 100 plus 15 over 100 and the second change is an increase also by five percent then a2 is equal to 100 plus 5 over 100 therefore a is equal to one point 2075 which is greater than 1 then we have an increase in price so we use the formula a equal 100 plus r over 100 with a equal to 1.2075 then 1.2075 equal 100 plus r over 100 after the cross multiplication we get 100 plus r equal 120.75 then r is equal to 120.75 minus 100 therefore r is equal to 20.75 percent in part 7 the price of an object increases by 10 percent then decreases by 12 percent determine the nature and the percentage of this change the nature of this change is the decrease or the increase in price and the percentage of this change is r so first of all we have to find a which is equal to a1 times a2 in this case since we have two successive changes then a is equal to 100 plus 10 over 100 times 100 minus 12 over 100 therefore a is equal to 0 0.968 which is less than 1 then the nature of this change is a decrease in price 
To find R, we use the formula A equal 100 minus R over 100 since we have a decrease in price. With A equal to 0 0.968, then 0 0.968 equal 100 minus R over 100. After the cross multiplication, we get 100 minus R equal 96.8, then R is equal to 100 minus 96.8, therefore R is equal to 3.2%. Please don't forget to write the exercises in this video on your notebooks. You have to do the assignment, which is from your books, page 39, number 2. And this assignment is due for Friday, April 17th, 2020. Thank you so much for listening.